Hi friends, I have a question for you. Do you like coming on my errands with me? I don't have anything else to do today but run errands and go to my doctor appointment. Do you like to come with me? Like, <laughs> does that interest you guys? I don't know, like, I don't have anything else to do today except for run all these errands. Actually, I don't even have that many errands to run. I'm gonna go to Marshall's, possibly Target, possibly Safeway, depends on what I find at each store. But do you like to join me like that? I don't know, I'm just kinda curious. But I'm headed out, it's 11 o'clock. Look at the house is clean. This is what happens when everyone does their chores. I don't have to do very much, it's fantastic. I mean, look, 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 look. The house is clean. Ashley has an ever-growing pile of moon sand and supplies. But you know what? It keeps her mellow. Let me get in the car because I gotta go. I'll tell you guys. I know that we literally live in the evergreen state, but I mean, it is so green. Green in the Northwest is a thing in the springtime. So let me show you around with all the green. Look at this, look how green those leaves are. I'll show you around. Our lines cross. We're wasting time on stuff that doesn't really matter. While wishing for something better. I try to fix things. Understandings and words unspoken. We fall apart, and I won't dare to say, Do you feel the same way? Okay, that went pretty good. She had a lot more bedside manner today, which was very handy. Maybe it's on my record for her to be nicer. Uh, she doesn't like my A1C levels yet, but she's willing to work with me on it. Before she's like, I'm not working with you on this. <laughs> and now all of a sudden she wants to, so whatever. I don't know. I talked to like my dad and my sister who are doctors and nurses and, and they're like, it's okay. That level is okay. You know, anyway, my doctor didn't seem to think so, but she does see weight loss and she does see that I'm feeling better and making more effort. And so she's gonna put me on a new medication to curb my appetite which I guess will be helpful but she said it'll make me nauseous if any of you have experienced this medication you probably know what I'm talking about let me know if you have any advice for so let me know if you have any advice for it okay so I forgot to bring my camera into Marshall's and home goods so I'll just show you really quickly what I got I got some socks for Chelsea she says she loves the pairs she's gotten but there was only six and she's like, I go through more than that a day. <laughs> she goes through like one or two a day. And so I got her some extra ones. And then I found these right at checkout. These are Dixie cups, but they're real. They're like real plastic and I love them. I already have these in all blue. And then one of my other stops was to get bath wash for um, Kaylee and Abby's bathroom. And this was on clearance for four bucks, this entire huge bottle or $5, but it's 32 ounces. At the store, it would have been like eight. So, and it's strawberry daiquiri, it looks kind of cute. Then I also got a body lotion. Okay, with the body lotion, as much as I'd love to use my Waikiki Beach coconut lotion from Bath and Body Works, <laughs> I'm flying through it. And so when I put lotion on my feet and my legs, like after I've showered or shaved or whatever, and I'm just going to bed, I'm not gonna waste that lotion just to go to bed with. And so I just wanted something that was easy to use right by my bed. And so I just got this one. This one was on clearance again for $4.50. So, um, and then it's also easy for the kids to come in and grab some as well and just kind of squirt it with the little, you know, thing on top. And then these cups I got because the teenagers and the kids that will start to come over for like the summer and whatnot. You can use like a, what do you call it? Dry erase pen on these. So the kids can write their name on it and then set them on the counter. And then they know that that is their cup. And I mean, who doesn't love these colors? I mean, 
<laughs> I was looking for the blue ones, then I saw these ones at checkout, and I was like, oh yeah, we're, these ones are coming home with me. And actually, Jason really likes these ones too because they're very durable. We don't use like plastic cups that we throw away. When people come over, we just pull these guys out and use them. So, you know, we're saving the planet a little bit at a time. Getting ready for summer. New York, but, Boston, Philadelphia. Oh, that's my book. Maybe I should tell you what book I'm listening to. So I find that kind of stuff really interesting. You can let me know if you're reading a book that's interesting. I am reading American Sherlock. Um, it is by, let me see if I can pull it up here, Kate Winkler Dawson. And it is The Murder of Forensics and the Birth of the American CSI. You guys, it is so cool to like learn about where these kinds of things happened and started. And like, it didn't just like magically appear that we had a crime scene investigation unit. Like, it's not just a TV series. Like, it like evolved and it's really mainly from one person um, really being fascinated with science and trying to solve murders and things like that. So fascinating book. Lincoln Highway is my next one up as soon as I finish um, this American Sherlock. Um, I don't remember what American or what the Lincoln Highway was about, but I'm curious to see. It was not one of our top 10 picks for book club, but it is on our um, extra long list. <laughs> and it popped up on the my library's, like uh, my hold. And so I was like, well, I'll just read it. You know, if I don't have something current that I'm currently reading for book club, I always kind of pick up those extra books just to fill in time because it's kind of fun to read. Actually, it's fun to listen <laughs> as I drive around. That's why it pulled up on my phone because I like to listen while I drive. Ugh, of course, it's not going to do it when, <laughs> when I have the camera on. Let's go home. Let's go home. Maybe you don't want to know what you don't see what you Yeah, so I forgot that I was filming today. Also, don't mind the mismatched bun sizes. I mean, <laughs> I might fix that in the car. But I'm running to take Abby to a yoga class. She has yoga at school for PE, but they're making her take a real class. I don't know, see their experience taking a real one. I'm trying to get my water bottle. <sighs> um, taking her to do that and then running to Target to get all my new medications. Also, just barely paid for a refill on my levothyroxine, if you know thyroid issues. And my do doctor changed the dose by 12 milligrams. And I was like, so... <laughs> Can I use the $75 worth of Levothyrox that I just paid for? <laughs> and then you can just like give me a prescription for the 12. <laughs> I didn't ask her that. I was just like, whatever. <sighs> Maybe my level will change again and I can go back down and use that eventually. Or I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll balance back out or I'll bump back down and I can use it later on. But I'm going to go to Target and do that and grab the only other thing I wasn't able to find. Where can I put you down? Today at Marshall's was mouthwash. So, I'm gonna get mouthwash. It's the next day. <laughs> Nothing else happened yesterday. Jason got home late. He went to dinner with his business partners. Sorry, I have my retainer in and I'm in. That's by the lisp. <laughs> he got home late. Then I took Ashley to her activity at the church and we did some planning for an activity in June and then played games and then we came home and the kids went to bed great. And I went to bed at 10 and it was fantastic. <laughs> but I was awake until two in the morning. So that's not fantastic. Back at Costco, I knew, I knew my kids were gonna be like, why didn't you get us any food for lunches? And I'm like, tell me what food you're missing for lunch. Cause I got a lot of fruit and vegetables. I've got a lot of cheese, I've got bread, I've got, yeah, like we don't have any goldfish or fruit snacks or chips. <laughs> Fine, I'm gonna go back to Costco. That's where I'm at right now, I'm sitting in the pouring rain. Um, I'm gonna go into Costco again and get them some of that stuff. My notes in my, my list is in my pocket here. I had a few more things on the list that I didn't get. Well, we, peppers. We are eating those little mini peppers like crazy. Sorry, I'm trying to keep the mint under my tongue. <laughs> We're eating the peppers like crazy. So I'm gonna get another bag of those. Anyway, we'll just keep going with this day. Ashley has a scan, an ultrasound scan the one that we model for and volunteer for. And I have gotten so many scans scheduled for me and my kids lately. They are just like popping them out. And I'm like, you guys are building up my supply of money for Hawaii next year <laughs> because mm -mm, it's gonna be good. I am getting so many. I have at least, like I have one tomorrow. Abby has one tomorrow. Ashley has one today, like so many. So 
good news. And um, also, I need to go and get my prescription from Target. I totally forgot about that. Um, interesting thing, my doctor didn't tell me it was an injection. And she wants me to do it first thing in the morning. So I'm not going to start it today because it's too late in the morning. It'll, by the time I get it, it'll be afternoon. So that's unfortunate. I did not know that. She did not talk to me about that. She did not explain that. She did a great job at her appointment. But that would have been nice to know. So I'm going to have to ask the pharmacist a few questions. Um, I've never done that before. So... I'll do that tomorrow and I'll take you guys along for that drive, that drive, <laughs> that whatever adventure. It was literally pouring rain on my way here. Look at this. Look at these blue skies now. Like insane. Like there's like not even a cloud in this. I mean, there's clouds in the sky, but there's like, it's like misting from way up high, I guess. But look at that. That's where the dark clouds are still. I think that's where the mist is coming from. Seriously. Bipolar weather here in Washington. I had my umbrella out. I was gonna, you know, walk in. It was a downpour. I had my wipers on. I had my back wiper on. I had everything. And now it's like, I need my sunglasses. It's so strange. Okay, this is life with kids. All snacks, fruit, and veggies up there. And they finally have these. They have been out of these for like over a month. So Ashley's gonna be excited. And I am excited to have her get a little bit more protein this way. Being gone on adventures for a while. No more. Cause the best thing about it is I know I'm coming back. Oh, oh. Of all the magic places in the world, I 